Dit is Papa Alpha 0 Echo Tego Echo voor de Daily Minutes met een nieuwsupdate voor vandaag, 16 mei 2015. Dit is het bulletin van zaterdag. Vandaag hebben we in het Engels het propagatiebulletin van de RSTB. Aan het eind van de uitzending is er een korte data-uitzending in MFSK 32 als test. Dit fragment duurt ongeveer 17 seconden en de tekst kan eenvoudig worden bekeken als je het programma FL Digi gebruikt. Zelfs met de microfoon van de PC voor de speaker van de zendontvanger. De centrale frequentie van deze datastream is 1000 Hz. CQ, 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 calling all radio amateurs and shortwave listeners. This is GB2RS, the news broadcasting service of the Radio Society of Great Britain. It comes to you from G4NJH. You can find the script on the RSGB's own website. So, good morning. It's Sunday the 17th of May 2015. This is GB2RS News. Now for the radio propagation report compiled by G0KYA and G4BAO. It looks as though we got the HF forecast for last week about right. They write, the KP index stormed up to 6 on Wednesday the 6th, remaining at 4 for the rest of the day. For the whole day, I should say. This was due to an enhanced solar wind stream above uh, above 700 kilometres per second and a southward-facing BZ component of the interplanetary magnetic field. This negative BZ means the solar wind coupled more easily to the Earth's magnetic field, allowing charged particles to flow towards the polar regions. The end result was visible, and radio aurora and depressed maximum usable frequencies worldwide. The estimated maximum usable frequency over a 3,000 km path at noon on Monday, based on the Chilton Ionosond data, was 20.1 MHz, but at noon on Wednesday it was just 18.4 the solar flux index was in the range of 150 to 167, which would have brought lots of DX had it not been for the geomagnetic disturbance. With the sun currently peppered with lots of spots, next week might be a mixed bag. NOAA and USAF predict a solar flux index of 145, declining to 115 by the end of the week. The geomagnetic prediction is more settled for more settled conditions, which may lead to better conditions on the higher HF bands, although solar flares and incoming solar particle streams may have a sting in their tail. VHF and up now an intense area of ducting from Portugal down the west coast of Africa brought transatlantic reception of the Cap Verde 144 MHz beacon in the Caribbean PJ4 on the 6th of May, while still present This will sadly be out of range for most UK stations. You will have to put up with mainly poor Tropo again. Of course, if sporadic E enables UK stations to couple into this duct, it could be a different story. Earlier in the week, stations in the south might have taken, might take advantage of ducting in the Bay of Biscay area. To compensate, 50 and 70 megahertz sporadic E is really taking off now with stations in the UK working Israel on on 50 megahertz last Thursday lunchtime. Be on the lookout for more frequent openings with lunchtime and early evenings generally the best time in this early part of the season. There are no meteor showers this week. The moon reaches maximum declination this week. So for EME operators, there will be longer moon windows with increasing losses as the week progresses. That's it for this week from the propagation team. It's also all for me for this week too. It all started in 1906. Hello? Come celebrate 100 years of voice over the airwaves with Ham Radio. Hello. 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 It's your world. Come get on the radio and say hello. De dagelijkse nieuwsberichten van de Daily Minutes zijn in elk geval de komende weken nog iedere dag om 1900 uur te beluisteren via PI2 NOS. Met een herhaling om half elf de dag erop ochtends. Je kunt ons mailen op het korte mailadres en dat is xapestatiexdv.me. En eerdere uitzendingen zijn te vinden op pnl.ete.nl. Wil je meer nieuws? Kijk dan bijvoorbeeld ook eens op handnieuws.nl. En kijk zeker eens op hobbyscope.nl, pi3uth.nl of pi610.nl. Daar kun je vinden hoe je deze fantastische repeatersystemen kunt helpen door ze met desnoods een klein bedrag te sponsoren. 
Tot zover de Daily Minutes voor vandaag. Dit is Papa Alfa 0 Eco Tingo Eco. De korte golfuitzendingen van de Daily Minutes zijn dagelijks om 1900 uur midden-Europese zomertijd te beluisteren. Op zowel 6005 kHz in de 49 meter band als op 7310 kHz in de 41 meter band. Er zijn de dag erop twee herhalingen. S ochtends om 10 uur op 7310 kHz en smiddags om 14.30 op 9560 kHz in de 31 meter band.